company. Today I'll show you how to replace the salt bridge and buffer solution in a differential pH probe. Salt bridge replacement is a cost-effective way to ensure measurement accuracy and extend the functional life of your pH probe. The probe consists of a salt bridge that we will remove and replace in this video. Below the salt bridge is a 10 to 12 ml chamber to hold the equitransferent buffer solution. The buffer solution gives the probe a baseline, a known pH value used to calculate the pH of the process. Salt bridge replacement requires the following. A new salt bridge, either Riton, which is black, or Peak, which is brown, depending on the probe you have, and equitransferent buffer solution. These items can be ordered on Hawk.com or by calling Hawk Customer Service. You will also need an adjustable crescent wrench, tweezers, and a container to collect about 10 mils of the old buffer solution. It is a good idea to wear gloves and safety glasses to protect your hands from your process water. The buffer solution won't harm your hands. First, clean any debris from the probe head by rinsing with DI water and gently scrubbing with a soft bristle brush as needed. Next, use the wrench to loosen the salt bridge, gently turning counterclockwise. At this point, you can use your hand to fully loosen and remove the salt bridge. Pour out the old solution. This is a non-hazardous, pH-neutral solution that can ultimately be discarded down the drain. The replacement bridge carries an inner gasket. If the inner gasket does not come off with the salt bridge, be sure to remove it from the ground rod using tweezers. Don't worry about damaging the old gasket. The replacement salt bridge comes with a new one, but do take care to not scratch the ground rod when removing the old gasket. To remove the new salt bridge from the container, first drain the storage solution, then drop the salt bridge into your hand. You will want to locate the inner gasket it should be in the salt bridge but may have come out in shipping and may remain in the container. If the gasket did come out, simply replace it into the salt bridge recess, making sure to fully set the gasket into place. Note that the inner gasket seats into the salt bridge grooves. Proper orientation of this gasket is vital in ensuring your pH sensor performs correctly. When properly seated in the saw bridge, the funnel-shaped side of the gasket must be facing out. Rinse the reservoir with equitransferent buffer. For ease of use, we have filled a squirt bottle with the buffer. Fill the probe reservoir with fresh equitransferent buffer solution to the bottom of the salt bridge threads. Install the new salt bridge threading carefully and screwing clockwise. Tighten the salt bridge to a firm hand tighten, then make a half turn using your crescent wrench. After replacing the salt bridge, it is critical to recalibrate the probe with 4, 7, and 10 buffer solutions to ensure accurate performance. Hawk recommends salt bridge and buffer solution replacement every 12 months.